Good morning and welcome back. So it's actually evening time for me. It's, uh, let's say almost seven o'clock. I think it's 6.30. Um, and I still have a bunch of stuff on my desk from when I did the live last night, but I wanted to come on here and just kind of hang out with you guys and do some more flower pieces actually. Um, because I really enjoyed it last night. It was a lot of fun. It was something that was different. It wasn't more Christmas cards, uh, cause I've been doing a lot of Christmas cards lately. Um, but yeah, I had a lot of fun. I did post some pictures of these, um, in the Facebook group last night after we got done with our live and that is what they look like. And then we're going to do some more. And these guys are actually dragons. Here. So I thought that was really fun. Um, so yeah, I'm actually going to try something a little bit different. Um, I don't know if it's going to work. I haven't tried it before. But uh, we're going to see. So I figure today is just going to be a let's hang out and play day. Are we allowed to have just a play date? So I'm just going to grab a handful of my little, my little guys over here. Got kind of random guys and we're just going to start putting stuff together. And I think I'm going to use the art glitter glue because it does dry fast and, um, it will stick to plastic, metal, wood, doesn't matter. And I'm also going to grab my tweezers, my trusted tweezers. And so I'm just going to, I may not even need the tweezers, but they're there if I need them. Voila. So we're going to take that one. We're going to set it over here. We're just going to, going to push these off to the side a little bit. <clears throat> and I'm just going to do a bunch of random ones here because I'm not real sure what I'm going for yet. I just wanted to see if it would work and it looks like it's going to work as long as I don't squish them. I think it'll be fine. Oh, and see, that one's really pretty. Like, that one looks like a flower. Because it's got the yellow center. That one's super cute. And then this one's green. And I am absolutely adding more glue on top of this glue because I don't trust the sticky on the back of these days. I want it to stay there. Oh. So, <clears throat> I got a special request today, and I really hope that I'm able to do it, um, but the request was to film while I go about my day, um, like if I go shopping to film and kind of take you guys along with me, and I was like, I've never done one of those. Uh, I think those are called vlogs. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, um, so I don't know if it's going to work out. Right now, I have my phone plugged in to my computer, and uh, I am uploading videos and such into my computer right now. Um, I don't know... I don't know if I can like so it just said that it was done but I don't know if it is done so I have no idea I'm just kind of learning these things because my phone is an Apple and when I had the Apple computer 
I could just plug it straight in and it was fine. It just did everything automatically. But because I have this computer now, which for those of you who don't know, my husband built this computer. So it is not an Apple. <clears throat> it is in fact, uh, the operating system used for this, comp this computer is Windows. So, I think there is a doggy in my room. There is a doggy in my room. Hello, doggy. I don't know if y'all can see her. Oh, she's on the other side of me. Y'all can't see over there. Um, but anyway, I was really worried that it wasn't going to work well. But it seems to be working okay. Um... Anyway, so we went to we went to Tuesday morning and we went to the Dollar Tree and I tried to film in both locations and it will be kind of a I'm going to see if this works type of thing because I don't know because Tuesday morning that I went to had music playing and I never noticed it before but then again I've never been recording while I've been shopping before either so it very well could have been playing the whole time and I just didn't realize it but that was my goal today was to take you guys along and then by the time I got home it was already like five o'clock and I was like oh I am so not doing this in today's video so I figured I'd come on here I would play a little bit we'll just have a play date and um, we do some crafting and chatting, you know, those things that we used to do all the time. And uh, <clears throat> I let you guys know about the hopeful, <coughs> hopefully it is an upcoming project. Hopefully. I don't know yet. Wish me luck, because I think I might need it. You know how long it's been since I've done editing on my videos? Even now, I don't really edit. I put them into an editing software, but it's just to boost my volume. That's it. I don't do anything else. It's just to make me louder. Which I don't feel like I need to be louder, but a lot of people were just like telling me. And I went on there myself. Like I was on the phone with someone like when she played the video and it was just silent. I was like, what is this? This is shenanigans. It was crazy. Like it was just insane. I think I want to do some more blues. I'm going to do the pink for sure. So I did uh, go to Tuesday morning and um, I also went to the Dollar Tree and I went to the salon today, the nail salon. And it was really funny because I was driving down the road and I asked because I had both my girls with me and I asked my girls, hey, do y'all want to go to the nail salon? Because ever since I bruised my nail, I've been having to go and get my nails done kind of like every week, every week and a half versus every three weeks because my nails just aren't as strong as they were before. So I have to go more often, which kind of stinks, but it's okay. That just means I get to change the design of my fingernails a lot. <laughs> but my oldest was like, Meh, I don't really want to you. But my youngest is like, yes, nails, yes, 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 nails, nails, nails. I was like, okay, I get it. Of course, we did end up going because finally Haven was just like, all right, you can go. I was like, yay. And then I wouldn't, I wouldn't take any other answer after she said that. Because <laughs> I was like, yep, you already said, yep, let's go. But she's not a very girly girl. She did get a manicure, though. And, um... And she told him no polish, and she was very upset when they put clear polish on her nails. I thought 
that was kind of funny. And I'm still just randomly grabbing these little tiny doilies from this little pile over here. I'm putting my little my little circles on them. My my little dots. And these are really great too to add to journals or scrapbooks because they're flat. Because some of the other ones that I use, like the metal pieces, they're not flat. So they will bulk up your whatevers really quick. Your whatevers. I had a big old huge cup of hot cocoa before I turn my camera on. But that was yummy. We had Burger King for lunch. That was actually kind of funny because I got the Impossible Whopper, Whopper, you know, the vegetarian Whopper. And it was really funny because I was like, yeah, can I get the Impossible Whopper uh, with no cheese and no sauce, just veggies? So it was like a veggie burger with veggies on bread. So I got a salad on bread, <laughs> essentially. <laughs> it was funny. I think I found it a lot more humorous than, than Haven did. She was like, Mom, you're weird. Like, what? It's funny. Oh, it's funny. <clears throat> all right. So once you have all of these little guys done, you can actually start layering to make another picture. Can make it into something different. And my youngest daughter and my husband are in there watching How to Train Your Dragon 2, I think. I was like, yeah, why don't y'all watch a uh, Christmas movie? And they settled on the dragon movie, which I thought was kind of funny. I was like, this is not a Christmas movie, but it's close. Kind of. Sort of. So anyway, what do you guys do to celebrate the holidays? Do you celebrate Christmas? Do you celebrate Hanukkah? Or Kwanzaa? Or Feliz Navidad? Uh, what, are, what are some things that you guys do to celebrate the holidays in this time of year? I'm curious. I would love to know. I think I ran into somebody earlier. Actually, it wasn't earlier today. It was the other day. I was on somebody else's live stream. And I thought it was just the coolest thing ever. Uh, but they said something about nothing Christmas for me. I'm Buddhist. And I was like, that is amazing. And I thought that was really cool. And I was like, that's like the second Buddhist I've met, even though I haven't met them. I was like, that's really cool. It's like, what do you celebrate if you don't celebrate Christmas? Do you celebrate anything? Maybe you don't celebrate anything. I don't know. But I thought it was just really cool. And it just kind of goes to show that this world is enormous. There are so many cultures and livelihoods and lifestyles and philosophies out there that it is just, it is simply amazing to even contemplate how big this world is and how wonderful this world is. It's just absolutely stunning. And I mean, sure, everybody can go and look at the bad things that are happening in the world and been like, you know, how can you be so positive? But I can be so positive because I choose to be. It's as simple as that. Because I choose to be. I've actually had a lot of people ask me, especially lately, but a lot of people ask me, how can you be so positive? How can you be so bubbly? It's not hard. You just choose. 
you make the choice. There's actually a quote that um, I'll have to find it. But essentially it says, your way of thinking is how you are. So if you think you can't do something, then you won't be able to do it. But if you know and think that you can do anything, well, there you go. You'll be able to do anything you want. So if you think a situation is going to be negative, it will be. At least for you. And if you think that the world is a great and wonderful, beautiful place to be, then it will be. But that's just one person's opinion. And that's all it is, just an opinion. But I think we could all do with a little bit more positivity in our life. Especially now, there's so much negativity swarming everywhere. It's nice to just smile. Just because. Don't you think? So I actually have a lot of these little tiny doilies. So I can probably do this whole sheet of dots. And then we can add these dots, our little dot doilies, to other doilies and make layered flowers. <clears throat> I like that one. I got all quiet. Y'all didn't tell me to talk. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Oh, it's already at 18 minutes. Look at that. Our play date goes by so quick. Who would have thunk? All right. So let's do a couple of these, like layer them up so you can, can see what I'm doing. So we'll take one of these. Take one of these. And then we'll take this one here. I think that'll be pretty. All right. And I normally don't use uh, art glitter glue for this part, but it's already out. So we're going to use it. Normally for this part, I would use Fabri-Tac. And there you go. You got yourself a cute little flower. We can do another one. Oh, there's a tiny little one. Let's do a, a yellow one here. Now we can put this like that. And then Oh, 
don't know if y'all can hear the TV. Because like I said, they're watching a movie in there. I hope it's not too loud, but... And then there you go. You got another little flower. Boop, boop. So now we have two little flowers. So your flowers don't have to be super complicating. They can be simplistic in nature. Be complicating or complicated or intricate rather, I think is a better terminology. Here's one that's a little bit more simplistic. Very simple, but very pretty. There's another one. Very simple, but very pretty. And that's it. And poof, just like that, we made four little flowers. But that's definitely not all because let's pin this back up so it doesn't dry out. All right. So we've got, first of all, we managed to make our pile a lot smaller than it was. And I think we made a couple of flowers. Yep. So yeah, um, I think we made a couple of flowers. <laughs> so anyway, thank you guys for coming to hang out with me. Um, Sorry, I was just looking at the audio because it looked like it was messed up there for a minute. Anyway, thank you guys for coming to hang out with me. I had a lot of fun creating some flowers with you guys. I really, really enjoy these colors. I think that they would make really great additions to any kind of spring or floral or garden type projects. So I really like the bright colors. Um, so thank you guys so much for joining me and I really hope you guys enjoy, practice, and get inspired. So I will see you all in the next video. Bye guys.